Welcome back to Enigmatis, the Mists of Ravenwood. It's been a day since I recorded the previous video, so I don't quite remember where I am or what I'm doing. Looks like I'm doing something here. I I'm putting pieces here, but I can't because I need three pieces. Huh, so then, then what am I doing? Hmm. So I remember that we were doing things inside this cave here in the camper, perhaps? Hint button, help me! Help me, hint button! You have been playing this game way longer than I have, hint button. So a powder would be useful. I've got flour now. Um, that doesn't seem to help. Huh, do, do I have something to brush aside the powder? Game says I can click here. I... 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 Hmm. I... I... Do I use the metal rod? Do I use my ring? Do I use my carbon diox... Carbon dioxide extinguisher? Usually we call those fire extinguishers. Okay, so the game highlights this section, and, and I, uh, hmm, most mysterious, yes, very, very mysterious, I don't, I don't quite see what I'm supposed to be doing here. Wait a minute, I've got a map which tells me where I can solve puzzles, so is there, there looks like there's a puzzle I can solve here in this top station. The map said there was a puzzle here for me to solve, but the hint button disagrees. Yeah, yeah, okay, so this this is starting off the, the video on the wrong foot. Uh, let's, let's just do some uh, backstory instead. Weakened worshippers, devoid of their master strength and power had no choice but to escape into hiding. Each to his own way now. Spread around all the far sides of the world. In the pits of their shelters. They would secretly continue their evil deeds. Worshippers waited until eventually the time came when in their hearts they heard their masters call again. Freaky, and we have five of those things left to find. So we've got five, five of them, and apparently there's something for us to do here in the tunnel. Hint said so. Am I, am I doing things here with this? Wait, 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 this guy wants to talk? You said the Reapers had to flee into hiding. So it was Raphael who hunted them? The Reapers lost much of their strength when their master was defeated. Though still immortal, they would easily be captured by ordinary people. Raphael's role was thus fulfilled when Asmodai was slain. His further fate is unclear. Had he stayed on Earth, it would have been his own initiative, not the Lord's. He would also have had to take the form of a human, so as not to cause an uproar. Okay. Okay, well that's it for the caves. Now let's go back to uh, the mansion. And this time I'll zoom in here. What does the hint say? Hint says I'm using that on the trees. Now I can break them with something heavy. Thank you! Thank you, hint button. 
you're 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 always a pal, a friend. I have a metal rod. Why did I want to break those things? I have no idea what I was trying to do there. Something in the camper, perhaps? If the game's just going to make me go back here again. Wait, what's this? I can click on vague area. Oh, okay. Move your mouse around all over, so... Okay. Finally! So this is a puzzle. I've seen puzzles like this before. Let's hope I can get this correct. Ah, I did! Oh good, and more backstory. More backstory, and then we'll finally be able to enter this mansion, I imagine. Centuries after his fall from the deepest pits of hell, Asmodai spoke to his servants, scattered around the world. All of them received the same message. Hunt each other and fight to the death until only one of you remains. Make use of the unholy ritual weapon, for unlike any other, its power shall break the bonds of immortality. The most powerful of my servants will be honored. For I shall claim his body for my return. So basically he decided to have all of his servants kill each other. Okay then. And wait, we can talk to this guy some more. You spoke of the ultimate ritual weapon. Is it the only way to destroy the Reapers? The Reapers used this unholy weapon in their rituals long before Asmodai was slain by Raphael. This ritual dagger bore the power of the demon, thus giving its wielder his strength, and the ability to destroy the other Reapers who were otherwise immortal, as well as any of their foul minions and creations. Man, those minions, and it looks like I've skipped something again. Poor me doing this game out of order. Actually, what does this X mean? That X means the path is blocked. Okay. So let's go inside. Now we're in the manor. Hey Becky, how's it going? Hope you're doing well. Uh I'm just I'm I'm not here to do anything with you. I'm just passing through. Man, this is locked. What's this up here? Ooh, a gem. Looks like we need demon heads. Okay. Oh, fine. Let's talk to Becky. You came for me. I knew you would. I'm fine, but I can't move. Hold on, sweetheart. I will get you out of there in no time. Um, somehow. Please, you need to find my parents. The bad man will do something terrible to them if you don't. Don't worry, I will find them. That's a promise. But first, I need to take you to a safe... That doesn't sound good. It's him. He's coming back. He can't find you. Quick, hide inside that cupboard. No matter what happens, don't come out until I call you. Promise me you'll be a brave girl? Okay, so we've been kidnapped. Mm, Not I good. I didn't think you would get this far. I must say I'm impressed. Now speak. Where's the girl? You won't tell me. Ah, no matter. Either you hit her or let her run. It won't take me long to find her. Why are you here? I must report. I saw the girl. Running to the forest. North. Outside the mansion. I can show you. <laughs> you see, I have many pairs of eyes watching. 
She can't have run far. My raven will catch her. Ah, would love to chat more, but you're not going anywhere. Now, if you'll excuse me, my other guests, a very nice family, are waiting. Uh, but don't worry, you're next. Seems like the ticket taker gave him a bad report so we could escape. Nice. Becky, it's safe. The bad man is gone. You can come out now. What happened? Is he going to come back? Becky, listen to me. I'm trapped and I can't move. You need to be a brave girl and get through to Mr. Hamilton. He will keep you safe. Can you do this for me? No, I won't leave you. You helped me. I'm a big girl. I can handle this. Just tell me what to do. Well, Becky, you say you're a big girl who can help, but you've spent most of this game hiding and crying. Becky, and you needed see a if you can reach bear. that sword on the wall. I can't. It's too high for me. Darn it, Becky! Try to move that chest over to the wall. I think you could climb it and reach the sword. It's too heavy. I can't move it. Darn it's it, okay, Becky! Sweetheart. We'll think of something else. <sighs> Becky, Becky, you are you are killing me here, kid. Uh, it says. See if you can open the chest. Maybe we could lighten it by removing its contents. It's closed, but I see a keyhole on the front. Okay. Um. I don't see any Hitmarsh keys. must keep the key close at hand. Try to look for it among the stuff on the cupboard. I found it! Yay! Well, this is an interesting challenge. Great! I'm proud of you, sweetheart. Now use the key on the chest and empty it. Seriously, like six books, that was it? We're almost there, sweetheart. The chest shouldn't be that heavy anymore. Try to push it now. I did it! I'm strong! Becky, stand on the chest. Very, very carefully reach for the sword, grab it, and bring it to me. I can do it. <laughs> Cute. And now I'm free. Maybe. Please hurry. We need to save my parents. Don't worry. I promise. I will find them. But first, I need to take you somewhere safe. But there's no time. I think I can help you with that. I misled Whitmarsh in the forest. He sent the raven out ranging and went to the tree himself. I'll take the little one to your friend in the logging camp. We'll wait for you there. No! I want to see my parents! Becky, be a good girl and wait for me there. I will return with your parents. You promise? I promise. Now go, and be careful. Okay, so we finally, finally got through that, and this is a hidden objects challenge. I haven't seen one of those in a while. Yeah, so, um, great. Now we can continue with our, our goal of destroying everything and, and you know, ruining this evil villain's plans. Why, why are there a bunch of miniature glass, glass things here? Did it go up here with the others? What is this, too? Hmm. I'm gonna use a hint. Oh, there's a magnifier. There's a corkscrew. There's a telescope.
Solving the puzzle gives me a corkscrew, which I can use upstairs, apparently. Giving me a key. Now, I needed a key for here. Let's see what this guy has in his study. Ah, life transfer. Oh, wait. Life transfer murders? A mortal outsmarted him? What? So this is about me. Somebody's mad that I outsmarted the preacher in the previous game. I can't smash the glass. It might break the vial. Can't pull it out myself. Crystal's grown. Vermont, please date. Interesting observations. The tree saps crystallizes. In theory, it could be used as a portable energy source. Is there anything I missed over here, Hint? What what uh, what did I miss? Ah, aha, I'm grabbing the acid there. Good. Ultraviolet lamp was lighting the board. Is there something hidden on the board? Looks like we're going to have to fix that lamp, maybe, if we can. There's a demon head, and obviously we need to find a combination for that. Okay, got both demon heads without much fuss. Raven pays homage to Master Asmodai. Living sacrifices shall be without end. And this looks like a puzzle. The coast holds the key to the Titan. New deduction available. Well, that's great. Okay, okay, hold on a second. How do I replace the ultraviolet light? Doesn't look like the game wants me to replace the ultraviolet light. Ah! Yeah, that'll work, that'll work. It's not exactly the thing I was thinking of, but it'll work. So now I'm finding hidden objects. I haven't seen one of these in a while. This is extra tricky because only some of the board is uh, available for you to see. So I'm going to cheater thing of just clicking on every single hidden object I find. Because that will eventually get me all of them. Cool, now I have a torn page piece. Where am I going to recreate it? Am I recreating it over here? I am. This is a jigsaw puzzle. Uh, all the pieces are in my way, so I can't see anything. Oh man, is this rough. Okay, so usually with the jigsaw puzzle, you want to create the outside edges first. I think this is already on its side, though. This... No, could be wrong. Okay, I'm trying to match these red pieces to each other. Yay! One! One match! One match! Whew! So if that's the upper, upper corner, then this must be the other upper corner. So this must be, uh, this must be like a, a piece that runs around the top. Let's just skip this puzzle. Clearly, that gives us some sort of clue. And it doesn't look like we're finished here, so let's just keep going. I... I definitely need a, need a safe piece. 
let's see what our evidence is doing now. So this is, uh, let's see, the motive is this. So it is all about demonic rituals. I've seen something like this before. Two years ago, in Maple Creek. Demonic rituals. According to the story I've been telling you, this shouldn't come as a surprise. It doesn't. But the way it works does, makes my flesh crawl. The roots are used to suck the life from the victims. It feeds the heart of the demon's imposter, who originates from the tree, the roots to be precise. The depleted corpses are left in the dark underground to rot. The whole area is warped and corrupted by evil. Twisted roots cover the land obeying the will of their master. Like heartbroken, helpless witnesses, their once pure owners, the trees, are now dying, joining the victims in oblivion. I have to end this, by any means necessary. I will help you, detective, as soon as I am set free. You have my word. Stop them by any means necessary. See, uh, we've got this evidence, and there's only one thing of what, what, what new deductions available. But what's my new deduction? I'm moving this here. According to this sketch, underneath the tree, there's some kind of ritual chamber. Wait, that place where I saw Becky's parents. The roots were growing wild. And there's a door at the bottom of the giant redwood. According to the sketch, there should be a passage that leads down to the chamber. This just might be the place we're searching for. So, the obvious conclusion is to find a way to open the gate. We, more like me, I'm doing all the work here, buddy. Yeah, I am doing all this work. What is this guy doing here? He's telling stories. The great hunt has begun. The one who had the weapon had the advantage over others and immediately became the first aggressor. However, bearing the artifact of desire, he would also become the most hunted prey. All in the name of a demon, Whitmarsh has killed so many people. The more victims Whitmarsh sacrifices, the more powerful he becomes, together with his master. According to what you deduced from the evidence, the heart in the demon's imposter is the key that activates his terrible machine of death. As it collects the lives of its victims, it is bound to Whitmarsh himself. Okay, looks like we're finished with this guy. Now, let's just go back to what we were doing. We were doing thing... Oh, well, we're finished with the house for now. Let's see if we can get inside the evil tree. The coast holds the key to the titan. So this is the correct sequence of the runes. Whew. Okay. Yeah, this this has like skip. Okay, here we go. I found the first one. Next, we're trying to find a pointy rock. It's not it here. There we go. This isn't as bad as I thought it would be. Yeah, no, 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 this is starting to become horrible. I don't know where this pointy, where this rock is. Is this it? Found it. Yes. I'll just skip the last two. 
Only one thing left to do. Find the rest of the pieces to the safe key. I bet there's somewhere inside the mansion. Is this a hidden objects challenge, lady? Anyway, I need to find all the pieces to the safe key. I, I think she's saying to get inside the safe. Because I want to open up the safe. Okay. So do any of these items actually work? Let's make some iced whiskey. Ah, nothing like investigating on an iced whiskey. And I think that was the safe part. That, that, that thing I picked up there, which said safe part, probably the item we are looking for. Let's just do some matching puzzles here. I'm getting bad at this. Okay, camera and cam and film reel. There we go. Okay. Now we can solve this. Okay, so I'm going to go right to four. And then left to seven. And then left to three. And then right to zero. And then left to six. More evidence, I see. Ah, the final piece of evidence. And just two of the metallic relief pieces, just there. Cool. Nice. Now we can go to the giant tree, but hey, let's let's finish with this evidence, shall we? Um, actually, what can I do with this evidence? Nothing? I'll just talk to this guy then. Let's get back story. Some of the worshippers would work alone. Others would temporarily join forces. Some would prefer to seek shelter and wait. Others kept seeking and hunting. Decades and centuries passed. And through murder, treason, and death, the ritual weapon would pass from hand to hand. With each new worshipper slain, Asmodai was closer and closer to achieving his goal. For the fading life force of each victim would be transferred, making the Slayer grow in power and preparing the host for the true master to be reborn. The time has finally come. When of the twelve dark spirits of old, only one remained. His name was Raven. The Raven, Whitmarsh's true name as a Reaper, the last one. Does this mean that- Soon he will become as Modai himself. If the demon returns, there will be no way to stop him this time. The power of the Reapers is no match for that of their master. We have to act quickly. There is only one more relief piece to be found. You know what to do. Okay. Only one more relief piece to be found. Can't do anything with evidence. Then I guess the only thing that's left to do is start another video.